Do you like anime? Do you like Japanese inspired things? Do you like clothes? I'm sure you like to stay warm. Well, I got this stuff for you. Introducing Imori.com, a website that introduces anime and Japanese inspired styled clothing made in house. And you can use the code Uchi15 to save yourself 15% off of all these cool, dope hats, beanies, hoodies, t shirts, sweatpants, and way more where that came from. That's Uchi15 at checkout to save yourself 15% off your entire order at Imori.com. What's up, everybody? <gasps> it's your boy Uchi, and uh, back again. Once again. How y'all doing today? All right, we got episode 11, Underwater Hunt, part one of Tower of God. We literally just have two more episodes after this. I've said, I, I would say that as far as the anime is concerned, this show has definitely had a pretty good run. If you've been watching and keeping up with all of the reactions, I definitely can uh, would like to say huge shout out to you guys. But as always, as a reminder to keep making sure you guys are liking the video so that way more people can catch on to these reactions. And I should have a playlist on, um, from episode one to now. Um, if you are watching them via the playlist, but definitely check out the playlist and also like I said Make sure you guys are liking the video because we are constantly trying to fulfill these channel goals right now Okay, but anyways as far as this anime goes it has been a pretty enjoyable one uh, Going this far I feel like I'm saying this right now because since we're almost at the end of this uh, first season I, I, I must say that even while it's in, nearing its end, it's constantly still like having all these twists and turns and you know, more things to the story are being learned and all this kind of stuff. So it's really good. And I'm actually looking forward to seeing how the recent events uh, envelop. So without further ado, let's just get right. Do you like Attack on Titan, Dragon Ball Super, Dr. Stone, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood? Well, those are just a few of the several different hundreds of anime selections that you can watch for free with my trial code for Funimation Now. All you gotta do is click that link in the description below and check out Funimation Now for a free 14-day trial period to enjoy all of these anime and many, many more. That's Funimation Now by using the link in the description below. Oh snap, the final test. Let's see how this turns out with Rachel, you know, kind of being in a wheelchair and all. So they're about to be hunted by net dolphins. And if they get captured by the queen dolphin, they essentially pass. So if Bam and Rachel are eaten by a worm, you fail. Barnacle goblins, what kind of animals are these? And there's a bull, monster that consumes everything that moves. Damn, even the rankers run from it? Okay. So now Kun is asking Shibusu why he's helping Bam. He's jealous of Bam too? So he doesn't want him to lose what he's got. What a nice guy. Uh-oh, that's a bull. Of course. Oh my god, what? Bruh. That ain't no freaking bull. That's like a demon thing. And it ate somebody. Did you see that? Holy crap. Dude, it's like literally a demon creature that has a sideways head. Oh my god. His one he large eye. Oh my god. Yo, if this dude dies, if Shibusu dies, I'll actually be really upset. That thing was not phased. Dude, it took a direct stab to the back of the neck area. And now it's salivating over him. No way. Oh, we got... Okay, yep. There it is. A knock. I was like, I recognize that green whip anywhere. Ooh, we got more Princess of Jahado. They're about to bet... Over what? Who freaking defeats this thing first? She's just trying to collect all the freaking like important weapons. Oh, if Anak wins, she'll be her servant. Damn. Uh -huh. <laughs> Damn, that's a lot of goblins. And then worm johns. So they're still going at it right now. I like how Shibusu is just there. Ew. I like how it has one random ass tentacle. Gotta say though, these princesses are mad strong. She was able to just break out of that like no, no problem. What kind of pizza is that? That John don't really look that tasty. I don't think we've seen what kind of creature that is. Oh, that's, is that hers? That's a divine sea fish. Oh, she got some sonar. Oh, damn, that's dope. Oh, so that's what's in that thing, okay. Ew, that thing grosses me out so hard. Kind of reminds me of like piranha plant a little bit. Not this again. Ooh, oh, snap, it was squeezing her tighter. Yo, it's stronger now. Oh, no. Oh, snap. Yo, are we gonna see a death during this episode? Wait. 
he's one of the nat their natural enemies who knew about her mom. Was that her mom's necklace? Bruh. Holy crap. Dude, that's, that's what I'm saying, man. So many things. So many things are happening at once constantly in this show. Freaking nuts. Bam's answer to why he wants to go to the top of the tower probably made Rachel feel bad. Because Rachel wants to get... She wants power. It seems Bam. He just he just wants Rachel to be happy essentially, and he just wants to be happy with everyone else, enjoying their company and eating together and all that kind of stuff. Bam's a good dude, and that's why she just said just now that he was amazing. Meanwhile, a Knox over here getting stabbed right in the chest. So uh, let's uh, yikes! Here we go. Uh, whoa, what was that? Whoa, who's who's does that belong to? That was him? Oh, was it really him? Oh, now they're screwed. I'm trying to about to get ambushed. Wow, her weapon got stolen. She's bleeding pretty bad. Yo, was this a setup? This seems like a setup. Yeah, that this is this guy number seven sixty seven controlling the bull. I wonder if this dude knew that freaking administrator guy. Now he's having her kill her. Dude, what the hell, man? That's it. That's part one. Notice that I think pretty sure the episode title. It did say part one, if I'm if I'm remembering correctly. But yeah, man, more developments, more crazy stuff happening. Now we have a situation between the two princesses of Jihad, where the one princess has to essentially kill the other one. And notice how that enemy that they was fighting, he kind he pretty much said and reminded us that she's not technically uh unknock the green the green chick that she's not technically a natural born princess she was kind of like i don't want to say fill in but it seems like that because i guess her mom was like one of the original princesses in that case and because he was you know kind of taunting her and saying like oh like her your mom died in vain because she's about to die now so pretty nuts with everything going on and like everything outside like them trying to make sure that they all pass <sighs> Show is pretty freaking nuts, and it only gets it only gets crazier. But yeah, I don't, I, I feel like next episode we might see a death, whether it's on the surface level or if it's one of the freaking princesses. All right, so that was your episode eleven reaction. Yep, I am seeing that it definitely was part one. So I'm guessing that the underwater hunt might end up lasting at least either one more episode, or it might just actually be the last two episodes to close out season one of tower of god i've been enjoying this like i've been saying constantly i think that what's been happening and how these events have been turning out i would almost say they exceed my expectation because honestly when i watch an episode of tower of god especially now i can never expect anything to like actually go as i would expect them to because it's kind of like a curveball in itself where we have all these things happening all these situations going on the the tests that get reintroduced or not even reintroduced but introduced to us as a whole it kind of makes predictions kind of go all over the place general predictions like with with characters like bam like i made a general prediction about him back in the first um episode reaction where i was saying that i feel like bam is of some kind of higher class or he was a part of this overall like system where i don't know that's the thing i don't know exactly what but i feel like either of some higher being or of some higher class that everyone doesn't even realize and maybe another thing that i could predict is that maybe some of these administrators might actually know the truth behind bam but that's kind of a stretch prediction we'll kind of see what happens as the story progresses um, but we're only going to get so much story this season because this is the part where I guess I'm going to have to shout out the manhwa if you guys are going to want to continue reading. If you're supporting these reactions and you're supporting these anime episodes, I definitely would uh, go ahead and recommend reading the manhwa. I know a lot of you that are watching these reactions as it is probably have already read the manhwa, but if, you're, if you haven't considered it or if you haven't thought about it, reading the manhwa i would definitely recommend doing that because you'll get the full story and from my understanding the story is not even freaking finished so with all that being said i am looking forward to next week's episode but guys as a quick reminder please make sure to like the video comment below what you thought of this week's episode and any kind of predictions that you might have if you're like me who hasn't seen what happens in the future of the story 
um, as far as the mom was concerned. Let me know all that and more. Uh, and, I, and of course, if you haven't already, please do ahead, go ahead and subscribe. Hit that bell alert to get all notifications for any of the videos that I will be posting in the uh, coming future. And oh, I will I should say this now that I will be doing some sort of channel update to kind of gauge with you guys and see exactly what you guys are going to be looking forward to out of me in the near future. One last time, like, share, subscribe, hit me up on Twitter, all that good stuff. Supporting links are going to be in the description as always. And make sure you guys are taking care of yourselves. Have a good one. May the power protect you. Keep it locked loaded right here on the Uji Games channel. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.